In this video, I'm going to show you how to replace the on-off switch on your Weed Eater XT10 string trimmer. The switch handle assembly is held together with a series of screws and a knob assembly. We'll start by removing the fasteners. With the fasteners removed, now I can go ahead and open the switch handle assembly. Now I'll remove the trigger, and I'll remove the on-off switch, and remove the wires from the wiring harness. Now I'll go ahead and replace the switch. You'll notice that the switch is a momentary type switch. At rest, it naturally goes to the off position. When I attach the wires, I want to take the incoming wire and attach it to the off side of the switch. Then I'll take the motor side and attach it to the on side of the switch. Then place the switch into the housing. Now I'll install the trigger. I'll make one last check to make sure that all the wires from the wiring harness are out of the way, and then we can go ahead and reassemble the switch handle assembly. I'll secure the two halves of the switch handle assembly with the screws and knob assembly.